Hi, good morning. Welcome to Business. My name is Daryl Kwao. The Continental Free Trade Agreement Secretariat, in collaboration with the AU, will unveil a new trading platform. The move is to ensure that physical barriers of trading amongst African countries are minimized when the trade uh, deal begins in January next year. Secretary General of AFTA, Wemkele Mene, made the disclosure at the second national conference on the implementation of the agreement in Accra. There's more in the following report. Express confidence that trading under the continental free trade area will begin in January next year, barring any last minute changes. After several negotiations and discussions among member states, the continent still faces the challenge of trade barriers, including fiscal barriers at various borders. This has compelled Ghana and other West African nations to explore the use of technology to increase benefit from the agreement. According to the Secretary General, Wem Kelly Mene, the Africa Digital Transformation Platform will go live before trading begins. We are exploring various digital-enabled platforms that are aimed at enhancing market access and trade connectivity of small-medium enterprises to new markets across the African continent. We shall collaborate with the African Union Commission to leverage the African continental free trade area to, accel to accelerate the implementation of the digital transformation strategy for Africa in order to transform production, sy production systems, promote industrialization, and the use of advanced technology in all sectors of the production value chain. We intend to launch this digital platform for trade for SMEs uh, connectivity in time for the start of trading under the AFCFTA, which is scheduled for the 1st of January, 2021. On his part, President Kufuado assured that Ghana as a country has put in place all the necessary blocks to ensure it benefits from the agreement. He indicated that policies like the One District One Factory and planting for food and exports are geared towards achieving this goal. Development of industrial parks and special economic zones in collaboration with the private sector to make available the space for industrial establishments obtain the economies of scale. Underpinning all these initiatives, is the development of a robust and resilient macroeconomy, which will establish a strong foundation for the trust structural transformation of the Ghanaian economy. I draw attention to these programs and projects to reiterate the, po the point that in Ghana, we have already laid the building blocks for our private sector to harness the benefits of AFCFTA. Additionally, the National Export Development Strategy serves as an appropriate policy framework for coordinating and consolidating public sector support for the development of exports. The ongoing national two-day conference is under the theme empowering Ghanaian businesses to harness the benefits of the African Continental Free Trade Area Agreement under the framework of the National Export Development Strategy. Eben Sabotage report for Joy Business.